What's up guys, Left Burst here. What's up guys, Lego Base here, and I'm giving Left Burst some Lego Base. If you've watched my channel before, he's kind of a small bay tuber, and he rated one of my live streams, which is pretty cool. But basically, I just want to share the wonders of Lego Beyblade with other people. So yeah, this video is going to be tailored mostly to Left Burst, um, showing just how the Lego Beyblades work. So first off are two of my iconic channel bays, LEGO Valkyrie and LEGO Achilles, which are going to have metal to boost their performance. They don't have very creative shapes, but I picked them because they have good structure and wouldn't break very easily, which is something you have to worry about in LEGO. Valkyrie is a super hard hitting attack type, literally probably the greatest recoil ever. I mean, they're cornered and it has um, a pretty fast driver uh, that doesn't have too much stamina. And Achilles is slightly less aggressive, but still has pretty good attack, and this very well-rounded driver, which is basically one of the best LEGO drivers there is. As for the other two LEGO bays, they represent most of the other LEGO Beyblade community, uh, mostly utilizing 4x4 bracket patterns, which basically means you have these pieces right here, and you build sideways out from them in a 4x4 square. It has a pretty generic system, where you have like a layer and kind of a core, and then this disc slash chassis, and this driver, where you can kind of mix and match with both of them. This red, orange, and yellow one here is much more on the defensive slash stamina side, uh, as well as the driver being a pretty good stamina tip. And this blue one is probably more on the attack side, but not as much as um, Achilles or Valkyrie, with a driver with a free spinning plate. So with all four bays, you'll notice that they all have these um, sets of studs across from the center, like here, 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 and here, and that's where you're gonna launch them. While most of the community uses stud down, which basically means something like this would be the top, and then the driver would go down here, I kept all the ones I sent to you just for ease of launching. Now let's talk about the launchers, since of course you can't launch these with normal launchers. So here I made a compact Lego ripcord launcher, medium ripcord length, and basically it works as any normal ripcord. This is left spin, when it goes in through the gear here, and you can switch to right spin. And you're going to put the bay attached to here. So for example, Achilles, you just put it on there and then launch, and it would come off. This is a problem that happens sometimes. So hopefully you find it pretty cool. It's a Spriggan color schemed launcher, mostly with red, yellow, gray, and white, and I guess black. And I guess, you know, Spriggan's just every color, except for blue at this point, if you count gold as yellow. And there's also another way to launch LEGO Beyblades, which is just to turn your regular launchers um, into LEGO launchers. So the way I do it, which is super simple, is you have this LEGO tire, fit these LEGOs in there, and just put it on the launcher. It should fit neatly on, and it should work with pretty much any launcher you choose. I suggest mostly using ripcord ones though, since string ones can get a little jammed up. As alluded to before, sometimes when you launch your bays on the launcher, they're going to get stuck, which is something you need to deal with. It mostly comes with experience, but if there's too strong connection, you sometimes have to put this on like halfway, so that when you pull, it's gonna fall down. For example, you put Achilles there, then launch, and then you put Valkyrie there, and launch. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, so that's all I have to say about my package. I really hope you enjoy it. Um, you've done a lot of mods in the past and hopefully you'll find these pretty fun too. With that all said and done, I don't expect to be featured in one of Left First's videos, but it would be pretty nice if I did. And I'll see you guys later. Lego Bays, out.